Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. We're going to pick up where we left off on the last episode. Um, we've got our axe, hammer, and our nails back after we had to beat up the drunkard for them. Uh, did a little more research on the combat aspects after after that was over with. Uh, I think I might know a little more about them now. But what we are going to do is go ahead and head over to the market and see if we can sell these items maybe uh, to get the money to purchase the charcoal. Well, let's see. This appears to be the charcoal burner's hut. Okay. Well, let's, let's talk to him. See. Good day. Okay, right now we have zero money. Let's go to sale and see what, what options we have. So the axe we can sell for 100. Same with the hammer and the nails. Okay, let's see what we actually needed. Okay, price is 0.5 for 50. Okay, let's go back to our quest log here. And let's see, buy a bag of charcoal. Buy a bag of charcoal. Okay, I don't know if that means just just one quantity, but we'll see what we got here. Because I don't want to sell all the items. We might be able to use them for something. Okay, sell. Uh, let's sell the nails. All right, we've added that to the basket. We get 0.8. Okay, that's the condition. I'll, okay, this this is the price. Okay, so we got 0.8, and the purchase price was 0.5. So we'll say accept one okay and the charcoal is 0.5 the nails are selling for 0.8 so okay we've got a haggle option down here let's see if we can haggle let's have a word about the price why not okay haggling works both ways whether you want to buy cheap or sell deer you select the amount you want to pay or get, W and S, and confirm with E, the trader, will then respond to your offer. If the answer is a refusal, he or she will make a counter offer and wait for you to respond. So, let's see what we got here. All right. Uh, let's see. Get 0.7, pay 0.1. So, we're going to try two here. We'll try to... Uh, Make it where we get 0.5. And make the offer. I'm finished. This is going nowhere. Okay, we obviously offended him. So I guess we have to start over. So let's try it again. We'll just go one point this time. See if we can sweet talk our way into a deal. Okay. So we want one of these. And we want to sell the nails. Let's check our basket. Same deal. And haggle. Let's talk about the price. Sure, why not? Alright, we'll shoot for point four. See what happens. What about this? It's not worth it to me. Try it one more time. This is a waste of time. Okay, obviously our speech isn't up high enough to really be able to haggle. So we'll go ahead and trade just outright. We want one of these. We want to sell the nails. Check our basket. Da da da. Close the deal with X. All right, done deal. Okay, now we have to buy 10 bags of charcoal. Okay, so 
Let's talk trade. So we need nine more bags. Okay, that's gonna be 4.5. All right, let's see what else we have to sell here. We'll go ahead and sell that and sell that and that leaves us with 0.1. Okay. Let's check our basket now. Maybe we've got a little more room to haggle this time. Let's try it one more time. I'd like to discuss the price. I. Let's see, we'll say get, let's pay. All right, we'll say get point one. Yeah, we'll try that. Finally, a reasonable sum. Okay. So it looks like we came out on the good side. We got point four back. Um, so I guess we did pretty good on that one. All right, now we're ready for our next task, which is, okay, that's a sword fighting lesson. We'll, we'll wait on that one. We'll buy ale at the tavern. I am going to come back and get that sword fighting lesson though. Let's see where we're at here. All right, we discovered the tavern. You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to? He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitors. Now even the Pope God be with you, Henry. Your king. I'm with you, Matthew. So What's going on here? Deutsch is spouting shit. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire. <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't forget about Kutenberg. Well, Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson, doesn't he, Fritz? You're too right, Matthew. We should give him a proper hiding. Oh, are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Uh, don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge pile of manure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? I see where this is going. Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it, to be honest. But... Doing some tears all day. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Hmm. 
to do or not to do. Okay, for now, I think we need to stay out of trouble. So I'm going to say I'm not going to. Not that I don't want to teach the Deutsche a lesson, but I really don't have time. Well, that's disappointing. Still, we can manage without you. Let's go, lads. Honestly, hell. How could you possibly chance like this? <laughs> All right. We're just trying to stay in the uh, positive ranks for right now. So let's see. Okay, here's our May Bianca. Lord watch over you, Henry. Let's speak with her. God save my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? <laughs> Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? A pitcher for father. I need ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Here you are. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> you can pay me back this evening. <laughs> Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> Thanks. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Vanyak. I suppose. He is a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. <laughs> I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, Savior Schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. All right. We have Savior Schnapps. Uh, let's see, the quantity is three. And we'll look at the item info on that. Liquor of exotic fragrance, drinking it is an experience that can't be forgotten. Uh, it's my understanding that's actually the way you save the game. So. Okay, it would appear as we have found Taylor, uh, unexplored place. Discovered a tailor over here. We now know where the charcoal burner is. That was the grindstone that we found at our father's shop. All right, we still need to go to the sword fighting lesson. So let's do that before we go back to our father here. May the Lord watch over you, Henry. And we discovered a blacksmith. So I would assume this is the guy that's doing our sword hey, fighting Pip. lesson. Do you want to learn something? No, I sure do. I don't think so. Fa Let's see what we can pick up from this gentleman here. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? <laughs> oh, it was nothing. Except mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready to get stuck in? Let's go. Yes. All right, I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual.
All right, I guess we'll follow him and see where he goes. Okay, we'll do the caps lock, and that will put us walking about the same speed he is. Maybe a little bit slower. That way we don't have to keep running up and stopping, running up and stopping. So he's let us know that he's got to leave town, so... I'm not sure if these lessons will continue. Well, I guess we'll find out. Uh, but I'm not sure where he's going. So we'll have to see if he gives us any hints on that or maybe even tells us. All right, here we are. So we'll speak to him again. So can we get started? We can. We can. Good. And since today is the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. Hey, wait a minute. I haven't learned anything yet. <laughs> Very well. Let's start with the basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. All right, all right. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around, you'll get nowhere. Try slashing from different sides. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. Okay, I'm not sure what we're doing wrong here. Okay, slash strong attack. I'm trying to do a, a light attack. Alright. And one more. There we go. Never did hit him. Okay, stab is a weak attack. Use the right mouse button, so. Good. good, good. Let's try something else. One strike I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Okay, you can chain your strikes together, start a new attack. As soon as the previous attack ends, you can change the attack zone or just chain the strikes one after another. Try to press left mouse button or right mouse button after you your sword hits your opponent. The window of opportunity is between the strike at the opponent and the end of the swing. Okay, so let's try this. All right, and again. Very good. All right, we chain two strikes. Nice. Chain two more. Fine. All right, chain another one. All right, that's enough. I don't know about you, but I'm tired and thirsty. Remember, though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. All right, well, I guess that's all he's going to tell us, so we'll head back to Pop and see what he's got. I don't know if we can go this way. Nah, it doesn't look like we can. So we'll make a run down this way. I 
All right. We have made it. Let's see what we got here. See what Pop's got to say. <laughs> Let's ask him about this first. What did you do in Kuttenberg? What did you actually do in Kuttenberg? Kuttenberg. Oh, all sorts. You had to be able to put your hand to anything if you wanted to make a living. But I was never far from iron. I'd like to see Kuttenberg sometime. I'll take you there one day, never fear. It's a beautiful city. But in the end, you'll learn the best places here by the Sasso. We've kind nobles, fertile land, and plenty of everything. And do you know Sir Radzig well? We've known each other long enough. About the things you wanted. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? I have. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. <laughs> Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Right. Let's see what kind of job the master in Sasal did for us. <laughs> Look at that lad. That's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? Damn if I know. <laughs> Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Radzig ordered it. Oh, this will be the finest sword I've ever made. Have we got the charcoal? Good. And fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. By the way, I heard some gossip about what happened to Deutsch. <laughs> I expect you know something about it. Nope. Not a word. Maybe. Maybe. Someone threw dung at Deutsch's freshly lime-washed house, maybe. And maybe those cronies of yours had something to do with it. That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the King. He got what he deserved. Oh, got what he deserved, did he? Look, I don't know if you're mixed up in this or if it's just those friends of yours. It's all the same to me. But I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody. Least of all the king. Do you understand? Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. Good. Then we'll never have this conversation again. So do you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of the king? Does that boy ever listen to a word I say? <laughs> I didn't have anything so to do with it, though. So rubbish. So what? You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, try using your mouth and not your fists. So we got a little life lesson Furnace there. Is ready. Right, we'll do the grip. I'll heat it up. When I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. Do it. Good. Once more. That's it. Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. And here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. 
He built half of Prague and a score of castles, had a bridge made over the Moldau and founded a university, and all without a war. He knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. But Wenceslas doesn't have it easy. It's hard to step into the shoes of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. Magnificent. Indeed it is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. <laughs> All right. Well, we have a customer here to pick up their nails. The sword has been completed. We completed a couple of quests. Henry, are you all right? <laughs> and she's giggly. Let's see if we can talk to her. Huh? We can't. So, she's waiting on us to go get the nails. But for now, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up here. And we'll pick up right here when we come back on the next episode. As always, please hit that like button. If you like what you see, please hit the subscribe button. Henry, are you all right? <laughs> yes, we're just fine. <laughs> please hit the uh, subscribe button so you can catch the rest of the series as always thanks for watching <laughs>